we will start with a super fine alpaca wool uh, with a little bit merino and also polyamide. Uh, about the quality, uh, it is uh, very very soft. Uh, of course, there are different type of qualities uh, for alpaca wools, but uh, this one is uh, is uh, very soft. It is also very light, so you won't need too much for for knitwear. And also, of course, it is very very warm. So you can use it for basically anything, uh, including uh, cardigans, it can be oversized sweaters, very popular for scarves and uh, hats, especially now when the winter season is coming. And this sample is uh, knitted uh, with a needles number four and a half. Well, four and a half up to five. You can knit it also on a third class knitting machine as well. This is uh, actually black color mixed with a dark blue, so it is a little bit melange. And next we will continue with a 100% baby cashmere wool from Loropiana. Uh, here you can see the quality of this yarn, uh, since it is baby cashmere and especially from uh, Loropiana. And then the quality is uh, exceptionally good. It is worth a try, at least a try. The colors are uh, very uh, light and uh, soft, uh, same as uh, the yarn. And we'll continue with the mohair and uh, mainly silk uh, mix. And then depending on the particular yarn, uh, it also has a merino wool or cashmere or alpaca. So here the combination of colors is uh, very interesting. Uh, so the main color is uh, brown with a little touch of a green. And also uh, you can see there's a little bit uh, blue color and golden vibes. Uh, and here is a green with a bronze lorex. And this one is a uh, blue with uh, a little bit of green also uh, and without uh, lorex and i would say this is a raspberry color uh, with a little bit of blue Next we have viscose, uh, which is metallic viscose, and this one is also multicolor and in two different thicknesses. Uh, so one is very very thin, uh, it is around 4000 meters per 100 grams, the other one is 950 meters per 100 grams. So you can use it in uh, many different uh, ways, 
course, you can let it as itself, for example, for some uh, details, but you can also combine it. And here are some uh, examples how you can mix it together. This time we will show you how to combine these viscose with different Macher yarns. And here are two new colors for uh, Merino wool with 10% cashmere wool. And we also have a lot of new colors for uh, composition, which is uh, mohair wool mainly and a little bit Merino wool and also polyamide. 